It can feel tough to balance a healthy lifestyle with all the indulgences of the season, but you can eat well and still enjoy. Registered dietitian Julia Dugas has some recipes that taste good and you will still feel good eating them. That is a good combination that sometimes yeah. eludes us, right? <laughs> exactly, so yes. What yes. is your first and strongest recommendation, would you say? For the holidays. So yes. what we're talking about here today is cutting back on the alcohol intake, but still mm. indulging a little bit and enjoying mm -hmm. the things that you like, like a glass of wine. Um, so what we have here is two different wines spritzers okay. so you're gonna do um, about three ounces or two standard shot glasses of your wine of choice you can do white wine or red wine um, this is a little more than half of a standard pour which is five ounces right um, probably a lot less than our typical pour that we're gonna sure. have at home that tends to get a little bit more than what it should be uh -huh. um, and then we do LaCroix so an unsweetened Smart. carbonated water yeah. um, and then as you can see here add in fun toppings whatever oh, you want to do yeah. for the holidays so with this one the white wine um, and the passion fruit LaCroix love doing cranberries right. Right. Um, and a sprig of rosemary. That Super is an cute excellent and fun. idea. Very cute and fun. And it's diluted perhaps also by the ice. Yes. So dual purpose. Excellent. Yep, for sure. Okay, so that's our drink category. What about all of the tasty treats? Yes, so these are no-bake coconut cookies. Okay. Um, the only ingredients in these is coconut oil, vanilla extract, um, coconut flakes, and then we use chocolate chips for the topping. Ah. Um, the first ingredients I mentioned, you're gonna blend all of those with dates in a food processor, oh my. roll them into balls, and then um, put the chocolate on top. We did some peppermint on top too for the holidays. Oh, very pretty. Yeah. yeah, that's fantastic. And so that is a really good tasty morsel that really doesn't have the bad effects of some of those no, really yeah. heavy, low Christmas cookies that we see and that we all serve. Absolutely, yep. And the portion size, as you can see, is very small as well. So you can just have a little taster versus a huge treat. I love that. Okay, yeah. so overall recommendation that you would have, and maybe this is a product too that you would recommend. Yeah, yep. Fish oil and magnesium, those are great supplements to take throughout the holidays to make sure you're getting healthy fats in. Those are great for brain health and your metabolism. Um, and then one exciting thing that I wanted to talk about was Commitment Day for Lifetime. Mm -hmm. Yep, so Commitment Day is Lifetime, really trying to get people to commit to one positive positive action mm -hmm. for you, your community, or your family versus trying to tackle five different resolutions. Because right. as we all know, resolutions, we start to kind of yes. wean off on those by like the February, yes, March time. Yes. Um, so if we can just do one positive thing, like go to one group fitness class, one you know session at the gym or yeah. volunteering in your community, something like that. Yeah. Um, and the clubs are actually open to non-members as well. Okay. So the, the clubs are open to non-members from December 28th through January 5th. Um, so make sure you go to commitmentday.com and just register if you're going to come so that they know that you're coming. Fabulous, Julia. We are motivated. We will do this. <laughs> we appreciate it. Now we actually have to do it though, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So thank you so much. And thank Julia's you. recipes are available at care11.com. Just search under the 4 p.m. show page. Once again, thank you for being here.